I'm kind of famous for being a note taker. I take more notes than anybody I know. And most people think I'm writing mostly about them. At least half of my notes are about myself. I write down, I wrote yesterday, I wrote XBP, which stands for Extremely Bad Play. <laughs> All right? And I, and I write VGP, Good Play. And once in a while, I even write XP, which means an excellent play. But the bad plays are far, far more common than the good ones. Anybody who's really honest, if he looks at himself, is going to realize he makes a lot more mistakes, what they call in tennis unforced errors, than, it, than great plays. And what we try to do, because we want to feel good about ourselves, is we forget the fact that we, we lost a bunch of money last night. But goddamn, did you see that great bluff I made on the river against Charlie? You know? Right, and another mistake is that when you're running well, you think you're the greatest player in the world, and when you're running bad, you think you're just getting unlucky. So it is important to take stock. You're trying to bluff opponents, but you got to be honest with yourself. Well, what you just dealt with is what is called by psychologists the attribution error, which is my wins are caused by skill, and my losses are caused by bad luck. And the attribution error is, again, extraordinarily commonplace. You can take almost anything that people do, and the overwhelming majority of people think they do it above average, which is, of course, a statistical impossibility. It doesn't matter whether it's dancing, driving, drinking, making love, playing baseball, playing poker. In all of these, we overestimate our abilities. 